The mozzarella sticks aren't vegan though, right? Because it's cheese. Uh, I don't know. No, still hate it. Hi guys, and welcome back to Wet Wales. Something's never changed. This is what spring looks like in Wales. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, well, hey, I'm back in my car. I've left my room. And I'm in a different hoodie. Still wearing a hoodie, but it's something. I like hoodies. Sue me. Today, I am going to try out vegan options at fast food places. We're going to be going to all the classics, such as McDonald's, KFC, Burger King. There's a lot of cars coming right now. It's making me uncomfortable. By the way, I parked in a, a permit holder's place, so I'm currently illegally parking. And the chances of me getting a ticket is like 100%, so that's great. But you know what? That's a risk I'm willing to take to make quality content. I don't know. It's okay. It's okay. It's, it's fine. Honestly, it's fine. I do what I can. I do what I can. So things I'll be looking for in this video today are A. What vegan options they have at these fast food places B. The price range Whenever you hear about vegan food One thing people tend to say is that it's quite expensive So blah 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 blah, blah I can't speak <laughs> I'm struggling today, I really am I just don't know what's wrong with me So I'll be looking at the price of these vegan foods And C. The taste Makes sense if I'm doing a food review video This place we're gonna go to is Great! I'm gonna just awkwardly wait for these people to leave so they can't see me filming in my... Oh, I got a message. For those of you... Oh, I'm really popular, aren't I? Now, if you're not from the UK, you probably have no idea what Greg's is. In which case, mate, you're missing out. Here we have a true testament to British culture. One of the finest things our land has to offer. Full of delightful delicacies. More commonly known as... A bakery. I kid you not, this actually happened. I once saw an Asian family take a picture of their son holding a pasty outside Greg's. If that's not the most British thing, I don't know what is. Greg's is pretty much like a, a tourist attraction, isn't it? <laughs> if you want to experience a true British culture, go to your local Greg's. It's got to be done. This video sounds like I'm being sponsored by Greg's. I'm not. I wish I was. Recently, Greg's was in the news a lot. And by recently, I mean back in January. I'm a little late to this trend. But let's go with it. Back in January, Greg's released a vegan sausage roll. The UK lost its marbles. All the Greg's across the UK had run out of sausage rolls. It was so hard to get your hands on a vegan sausage roll. You'd have to be put on a waiting list. They were like the supreme of sausage rolls. I personally didn't get what the hype was about because it turns out they're just corn sausages, which you can buy at your local supermarket. I really hope I'll be able to get one today, otherwise this content is going to be very anticlimactic. Walking into Greg's, I was nervous. It could go either way, and I could be left empty-handed. And just as I was starting to doubt it, I found them. Just look at those beauties. Hi, can I get a vegan sausage roll? Whoa, I took my glasses off and I can't see. I am so hungry, so I am really looking forward to this. This is what it looks like. Here we have the infamous vegan sausage roll. You're lucky to even be able to get your hands on one, let alone be able to try it. Hmm. After careful consideration and truly taking in the flavour, I came to the conclusion... That's not that bad. I don't normally have sausage rolls anyway, so I have no idea if it tastes like meat. Oh, it's a bit dry. I haven't got any sauces on me. Oh no, I make a rat mess in my car. In terms of taste, I'd give this an 8 out of 10. The only thing is, it's very dry and I don't have any sauces. This with ketchup would have been amazing, but I don't have ketchup on me right now. This only cost me a pound as well. Pound, vegan sausage roll, sorted. I've got crumbs all over me. I definitely need to get a drink though, because I am so thirsty. Oh, I can see again. Next stop is McDonald's. Right, I know in my last video, I said that I'll never go to McDonald's ever again. But at this point, you should realize that I say a lot of things that I don't mean. Technically, I'm not doing this for me. I'm doing this for the content. Next stop is McDonald's. Let's see what vegan options they have there. Hi, do you have any veggie options? Uh, vegan options, sorry. We've got like the veggie gelato, which you can like, pick up the sauce. So we've got the veggie wrap. Can I have that without the sauce then, please? Can I have fries with that as well? Yeah, thank you. I asked them about the vegan options and they suggested getting the veggie deluxe, but they put no mayo in it. So, so really should not be having, having this. The McDonald's fries are the best fries you can get. <sighs> I didn't get any sauce. I didn't get any sauces again. What's wrong with me? Oh, that's so sad. Can't even go back to their sauces, can I? And I also got a bottle of water. Also vegan. Oh, you know what? I think this is basically the wrap 
just in burger form and I didn't like the wrap. Oh God, that is the saddest burger I've ever seen in my life. So this is what the burger looks like. They didn't even give me tomatoes. How sad is that? So it's basically the goujons and um, the lettuce. So this meal came to a total of £4.59, which isn't bad. £5 for this meal, I guess. I was hesitant to try it since I didn't like the vegan wrap. <laughs> I still wanted to believe this would be better. By some miracle, it would taste completely different. This is not nice. The main lesson we're learning in this video is always get sauces. Honestly, the lettuce is the best part of this. I mean, they have attempted to make it a bit spicy, but obviously I love spice, so for me this is nothing. It's okay. I'm just not excited about it. Like, if this is the only option they have and I was a vegan, I'd be quite sad. <laughs> I'd be really sad. My goujon just dropped out. And also the goujons drop out if you're not careful. I don't know why they do it as this shape. Why not just do one big patty? I was expecting to get like one big, you know, like a veggie burger. I was expecting a veggie burger. This is just goujon stuck in a bun. I've been, I've been lied to. I've been let down. Thankfully I got the fries. No sauces. But oh, this is turning into such a fail. The fries are a 9 out of 10 because I love the fries. Water. 9 out of 10 because it's water. The burger, like a 5 out of 10. It's okay, I'll, I can eat it. I just don't like it. Oh, these are stale. Maybe the mayo would have made all the difference in the burger. How can something that tastes so good be so bad? That is, hands down, one of the saddest burgers I've ever seen. Kind of disappointed with that. Okay, so next place is KFC. Let's see how many vegan options KFC have. I'm not feeling too optimistic. Oh child, are you really going to ask for vegan options? I can't wait to see this. What if they laugh in my face if I ask them for vegan options? They'll be like, have you come to the right place, love? It's a bit weird coming to a fried chicken place and asking for vegan options, but it's gotta be done. We live in a world where we're trying to be inclusive, so they might surprise me. I mean, I can always get their baked beans. That's vegan, isn't it? I swear, veganism makes me question everything. I start thinking that nothing's vegan in the world. Oh, I feel so sick. I'm only two fast food places in and I've already crashed. This is why I vowed to never have McDonald's again. It just makes me feel so bad. Oh, there's a bunch of kids here. Little kids scare me. Kids on bikes make me very, very uncomfortable. Watch me get bullied by a bunch of 12 year olds. Look at the KFC, how can I help? Hi, do you have any vegan options? That's so good. I'm oh, sorry, we don't have any vegan options, only vegetarian. Are the fries it's vegan? It's both in the same fry as popcorn chicken. Oh, uh, okay, that's fine then, thank you. That is so awkward. Oh my god, that was so awkward. I'm just gonna have to drive past and be like, okay, bye. It's so awkward. I'm not gonna make any icon, I'm just gonna drive past. Wow. Okay, so it turns out they don't have any vegan options and the fries are cooked in the same oil as the popcorn chicken. So I'm just gonna walk away now. Gonna, just gonna go away, but that's fine. Oh, that's so awkward. Oh, that was so awkward. All right, we're moving on. We're moving on. All right, next place we're gonna go to is Burger King. Hi, can I take your order? Hi, do you have any vegan options? We do the veggie box meal, so you can have the veggie bean burger with fries, three mozzarella sticks, and a drink for $4.99. The mozzarella sticks aren't vegan though, right? Because it's cheese. Uh, I don't know. Wait. Cheese? It can mean part of cheese, don't it? Yeah, the, sorry. We could do it without the mozzarella sticks. What does the burger, does the burger have cheese in it too? Uh, we could do it without cheese. Yeah, that would be great. Um, can I have the burger and yeah. the fries? Do you do any sauces? On the bean burger, we do ketchup and mayonnaise. Okay, can I have it without the mayo? Yeah. I'm the one you spoke to about. Okay. Sorry, I get confused with vegan and... That's alright, that's alright. That is so funny. To be fair, they deal with meat all the time. So I, I guess it's understandable that he didn't really know what vegan options were. But the fact that he said, um, oh yeah, we do a vegan meal uh, with mozzarella sticks. And I was like, it's mozzarella vegan? I'm pretty sure that's cheese. This came to a total of four pounds and three pence so it's cheaper than mcdonald's with this i only got the big oh that's a massive burger it's more like a roll than a burger and i also got whoa these are big chips as well these are massive oh i got sauce this time yay i got sauce i got sauce
I got the sweet chilli sauce. Oh, that smells amazing. I'm just excited I got sauce. Oh my god, honestly, the sauce makes all the difference. The sauce, 10 out of 10. The fries don't taste of anything. So I'm gonna give Burger King fries a 3 out of 10. Well, the burger is intense. This is the burger. Oh, and they got tomatoes in it. Okay, I'm already happy. That's already better than McDonald's. Oh, it smells like the same thing as McDonald's. I think I just bought the same thing as McDonald's. Oh no, I've got ketchup all over me. Oh, that's really sad. The tomato tastes good. Oh, it's really hard to eat this without it slipping out. And it's really messy. I'm not really that bothered about the bean burger, to be honest. Oh, that's hot. Come on. Oh, let's see. I'm going to put some of the sauce on it and see if that makes a difference. Because right now, I'd give it like a 2 out of 10. It's really not that great. All right, take two. Nope. I hate it. This is kind of a fail. I don't like this at all. Also, I don't even know if it's vegan. Because the guy didn't really know. For all I know, there could be egg in this. Oh, that's bad. This is actually worse than McDonald's. Oh, no. This is really sad. At least I can have my chips with sauce this time. Moral of this video is always get sauce. I am so sticky and I feel gross from eating all the fast food, junk food today. And I just wasted my money on food that I didn't like. What great content. Just solid, solid content. I would give Big King a total of 3 out of 10. It was really disappointing. I will say, though, the guy who served me at Big King was really friendly, super nice, super nice guy. Bless him, just didn't know what vegan options were. I was hoping by the end of this video, I'd be like, oh my God, I love all these vegan options. This is amazing. Um, and it just didn't happen. Oh well, you live and learn. This has been my personal experience with vegan options in fast food places in the UK. Maybe it's different from where you're from. I pretty much went into this having no idea about vegan options in fast food places. So, if you have any recommendations and would like to see a part two, let me know. Alright then, lads. I think that's the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I shall see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And remember to click the tab.